good afternoon. It's uh, Sunday the 28th of April. It's uh, Lionheart84 here at Brett. And I've just come outside to film my pawpaws in flower. Um, Acemina triloba. Um, first time they're flowered. This plant is a variety called Prima, which I bought from a company called Lubera. Now they have a UK website, but I think they're actually a German company. And I just thought I'd show the um, development of the flowers. Going to be a little bit about our focus, but um, they start off very small and light green, and they gradually turn from green to sort of a, a light pink colour as the flowers age and then they end up a dark purple colour. Now I can't really detect much scent on them but uh, they are, uh, they've got a slightly fetid smell. They're meant to smell like rotting meat apparently in their own uh, Apparently in their natural environment in North America they are pollinated by beetles and flies mostly. Now interestingly I have seen a couple of flies on the flowers but I'm pretty sure in this country I'd have to hand pollinate them to have any chance of flowers. Um, didn't expect them to flower till mid-May so it's quite nice to have them flowering in uh, April. I have actually seen a couple of flies on them so they must have some kind of scent. Um, interestingly as they ripen the, as the flowers age they sort of turn into a dark reddish purple colour which does actually kind of look like uh, bad or rotting meat and apparently the flowers are meant to smell like rotting meat so uh, there's quite a fair number on the plant I did look inside them and I haven't seen any male pollen because apparently the male pollen comes out several days after the female parts of the flowers are ripe so you have to really cross pollinate with different flowers they don't pollinate themselves or ideally with other varieties but apparently Prima is supposed to be self-fertile. This plant I think is about a three-year-old grafted plant and in the pot it stands a little bit taller than me, six feet tall now but I'm really pleased to see some flowers on it because this is the first season I only bought the, car, uh, the plant last autumn and I wasn't expecting to see any flowers on it this year so I'm really pleased, I'm not very used to focus on them outside but uh, nevertheless very satisfying to see some flowers and um, Probably, I hope in the next year or two, might get to see some fruits. I don't think we'll see anything this year because um, I'm not sure if I've got anything to cross pollinate with, but nevertheless, very pleased. Growing in a container, everybody says you can't grow them in containers, but I, I think if you start them out young enough, the roots will adapt to the uh, containers. We'll see what happens, but just thought people would be interesting to see that these flowers actually in flower outside their native America and just to show that you can get them to flower in the UK. Thank you for watching, this is Lionheart84 out, um, by all means click like, share and subscribe if you wish to. Thank you very much for watching.